China preparing for North Korea crisis, mass exodus by building refugee camps on border. China has started construction on a network of refugee camps along its 880-mile border with North Korea, quietly preparing for the mass exodus of refugees that the collapse of Kim Jong-un's regime would potentially cause. Detailed plans for the camps intended to house thousands of migrants who would flee a crisis on the Korean peninsula, emerged after internal documents from a state-run telecoms giant went viral on Chinese social media site Weibo on Thursday and were reported by the Financial Times on Sunday. The telecoms company appeared to be tasked with providing the camps with internet services and the document stated that camps were planned in three villages in the Qingbai County and two cities in the northeastern province of Jilin, on the border, on state-owned land. The document, which Newsweek could not independently verify, said, due to cross-border tensions and the communist. Party Committee and Government of Qingbai County has proposed setting up five refugee camps in the county. According to the document, China Mobile was asked to make preparations due to the tense situation along the North Korea border. It also gives the exact names and locations of three sites, Qingbai Riverside, Qingbai Shibladagu and Qingbai Jigain Lizai. In addition, The New York Times reported that centers for refugees were also planned into Men and Hun Chun, citing a local businessman, who remained anonymous. The two cities have previously housed several defectors due to their proximity to the North Korean border. Qingbai County, in the southern Jilin province of China, faces Hyson in North Korea. It is so close that residents felt the tremors from Kim Jong-un's most recent underground nuclear test that was conducted on September 3, according to Zim Hewitt, China's national news agency. The government has ordered these settlement points, said a spokesperson for China Mobile's Qingbai branch. But don't worry, no one is panicking here. It is not a big deal. Liu Kang, a spokesman for China's foreign ministry declined to confirm the camps were being constructed at a regular press briefing on Monday, but did not deny their existence. I haven't seen such reports, he said. The secret construction of the camps reflects growing concern in China about the potential for political instability or even regime collapse in North Korea. Tensions have risen on the peninsula over recent months due to Pyongyang's intensifying efforts to develop nuclear-tipped missiles capable of reaching the U.S. mainland, and an increasingly bellicose rhetoric from the U.S. and North Korean leaderships. Zhang Liangai, a professor of international strategic research at the Communist Party's Central Party School told The New York Times that China making such contingency plans was absolutely reasonable, given the situation. It is highly possible that there is a conflict between North Korea and the United States now, Liangai, said. What China does here is to be prepared for any kind of situation happening on the Korean peninsula, 